came in and is out now so go check out your store because all that nice Father's Day stuff is out. I'm probably going to get more um, Father's Day items like later on um, like next week probably. However I picked up a couple of them or three of the five that are out I think. There's only five I think. Um, I picked up three of them because why not? This is called the Thanks Dad Soap, and it is super cute. Oh my god, it smells so good. It has the word dad on it on the little block. It's supposed to look like a little, you know, like kid's block and toy. <laughs> and it just smells like orange juice, like really fresh juice of an orange. It has Brazilian orange oil, which gives it super zesty, like uplifting orange scent, and it is really, really nice. I would definitely suggest picking up one of these. It's only $5.95 and it is a great little block of soap and it's really cute. It's gonna be a really great gift for dad. So definitely look at that when next time you're in the shop. The next one I got is the Mod Father, and this one is supposed to be inspired by the 60s, like the design of it. It's supposed to be inspired by the 60s and like going into things modern. So I don't know, it kind of has like a little like modern like circle on circle on circle look um it actually shares the same scent as the dad soap thanks dad soap that i just showed you so it's just super zesty orange scent um yeah it's definitely a lot more fragrant in the soap than it is in the bubble wire but it's still super nice and cute and it is just a like small little um bubble bar and it's just adorable and perfect for dad because Men love citrus scents, am I right? Yes. Husband says I'm right. The, um, the model logo is something from the 60s or something. That's what it's shaped like. What's the, the model like, logo? The Target kind of logo thing, right there. It's like, it's a very famous logo from, um, like, the mod era. Like, mods are like, you know, like, you have, like, punks and... Uh-huh grunge people and stuff like that. Yeah, mods were like a, a thing. So husband's telling me that this is a logo from the mod era. The little like target circle thingy. So yeah, so cool. And that's what's called the mod father. Makes sense. However, my little like red part of this keeps falling off like that. Um, but yeah, all you have to do is lick your finger and like put it on and then it will like stick on a little bit better but yeah the next thing I got is the super dad um, bath bomb how cool looking is this it's just like super dad you know like a um, what's it called like a comic book like pow or bang or dad like so cool um, this has such a great scent it's um, sandalwood and albanium, albanium oil, <laughs> which is um, like frankincense, a di like a different derivative of frankincense. Like they get their resin and it's called albanium oil. Um, but it smells so nice, super like kind of woodsy, um, like a very warm um, earthy scent. Not how like, I don't know, some earthy scents are kind of like cold or like kind of smell like watery or something. This is a very like warm, like toasty kind of um earthy scent and it's super nice Scott you should smell this tell me what you think get the man's perspective mm -hmm. you like that mm -hmm. what do you think about it it's good it's good husband seal of approval Okay, those are all the Father's Day things that I picked up so far, but I did get a couple other um, things just for the funs of it. So, can you guess what I got next? Of course, I got the Lava Lamp bath bomb. Oh my god, it smells so good. This bath bomb is so cool because actually all of these, these three purple dots are actually bath oils. So, as the bath bomb, you know, fizzes into your bath, it lets out all this gorgeous oil and it actually looks like a lava lamp because all of the like purple kind of like separates from the orange and you can like move around little lava lamp 
bits and it is super super cool um, and also these can be these are really moisturizing if you really like like get them once they get more mixed up into your bath um, they are really moisturizing because they are bath oil the scent of this bath bomb though is like making me so happy I think this is a perfect summer bath it has Sicilian mandarin tangerine and orange flower and I think you really pick up on the tangerine. It's a different scent than any of Lush's other um, orange scents. I feel like this one's really sweet and floral at the same time. But this is just the coolest bath bomb ever. Gosh, I'm so excited to use this. Yeah, eventually there will be a demo. I'll have a demo out for this. However, currently we are having a little crisis in our bathroom because <laughs> um, when I washed my hair it literally dyed my entire tub and shower it looks like I like murdered a, a smurf in there because it's just blue like dripping down the walls really creepy and eerily and all down the shower and the tub so trying to fix that with a ton of bleach and like vinegar and all these different like home remedies to get hair dye out of the shower but we're figuring it out then don't worry there will be a million more bath bomb and bubble bar and demos and um, like bath cocktails don't worry it'll be up soon <laughs> the next thing I got is gold fun you guys know I absolutely love fun and I love the honey I wash the kids scent so I had to get me some gold fun because gold fun is honey I wash the kids scented um, yeah we just when I like was working last had just gotten these new bars of fun in and so they are just like super soft and new and awesome so um like it was a new shipment of these gold ones so I thought I had to pick one up since you know they look really really nice and fresh so I got one of these and of course the scent is amazing it's got that honey toffee scent with a hint of orange oil and this one's cool because it has lots of gold luster in it so it leaves your bath this really gorgeous golden color and with a little bit of luster in it I use my fun for baths um, so that's why I said bath but you can use it with however you like to use it <laughs> I got another honey I wash the kids scented item and this is soft core massage bar oh my god this is like this is the closest thing I've had to having um, Honey I Wash the Kids perfume. I literally, at work, put this on like before I leave because I want to smell more Honey I Wash the Kids and it smells so good. I could just stand around and just smell this all day long. It is that Honey Toffee amazing scent and it's just so beautiful and it's, I think I said this, no I didn't say this already, I don't know. It's pretty affordable for a massage bar. I think this one is only $8. Get you a softcore massage bar if you like Honey I Wash the Kids. And the very last thing that I got uh, is a little gift for myself, of course, of the relaxed gift, relax gift set. I um, have been wanting this gift set for a really long time, and since I got a job there and I can, you know, get it with my discount, I figured I would get one for myself, and so I did. But I will be unboxing this in a separate video to come in a couple of days, so be on the lookout for that because this gift set is really really cool it has an exclusive product that you can't get in any stores other than in this gift set okay so that is everything that i got last time i went to lush i hope you guys enjoyed this haul be sure to let me know what you think of the father's day line i think it is so cool that lush is finally doing a father's day collection since you know mother's day is such a great um collection for lush they you know father's day is just as awesome and it has some really cool unique scents um i will probably be buying more father's day stuff um so be on the lookout for another haul with more father's day stuff because i actually have to get stuff for my dad um, this is just for myself. Um, but yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching, um, and I will talk to you all next time. Bye! Hey guys, what's up? Today I have a video that was requested, um, just all about the Lush Kitchen. I'm going to be answering, like, what is Lush Kitchen? How do I order from the Lush Kitchen? Um, and pretty much I don't know, any sort of questions you might have about the Lush Kitchen. I'm going to try and cover anything that I can think of that um, might be confusing.